Mr. Somnath Bharti, you have been accused of attempted murder. Am I speaking with an attempted murderer? That's a very interesting question. In fact, if you look at the whole sequence of events, uh, why was 307 slapped on this uh, fire? There is a reason behind it, a political reason behind it. The reason is that 498A and 406, the police can no longer arrest in the manner they used to do earlier. The Supreme Court directions are there because of Arnish Kumar judgment. So for the police to arrest me and for the police to have its masters pleased, they had to have a section under which they could easily arrest me. That is why 307 was slapped. It was not that there was a murder involved in this. There was an att attempt to murder involved in this. I've supplied you a tape. That tape clearly says what I'm trying to say to you. I never ever let my dog go on my wife. I never ever directed my dog towards the wife. This is ridiculous. A pet of the house can never be directed by one family member against the other. Experts say so. 307 was a political, politically slapped section on me to ensure that I get arrested. That is the reason they slapped attempt to murder charge on me. Now the court has given you 48 hours of breathing space. What are you going to do now? The first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take my dog, write a letter, approach Mr. Uh, the gentleman who is the head of this, who's, who's heading the entire uh, prosecution, uh, the, the, investigation. The, the investigation. I'll be there. So I'm, today I'm going to be taking my dog and going there. Well, I read in the newspaper, the cop was saying that they have to, res they have to recover the dog. The dog in my, is in my office. He's always available. So I'll, 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 I'll do this exercise as envisioned by honorable police officials, as guided by their political masters, I'll carry the dog. But how did it come to this? You've been married, you're a lawyer, you know the world, you're a politician. Now, you got to a stage when you're hiding from the world. Where were you hiding in any case? I was not hiding from the world. What I was trying to do, it is Modi police. And I don't want to give in to Modi police because the intention of there was not only to arrest, that was to torture. 007 was slapped because of that. 498A, they can no longer arrest. I knew that courts will understand this. And I just wanted one day. I'm going to be giving whatever they want, all proofs which they can build the case further. Let them build the case. I hope they have possibly pleased their political masters. But attempted murder apart, there is domestic violence. Clearly, your personal life has not been very good. And that has been... Are you trying to say that that has been taken advantage of? So naturally, the idea there is that in every marital life, there are, there are differences and such occasions do arise. In my case, my wife has been insisting time and again that she does not want to move into my house. Okay? She does not want to live with my mother. I'm trying to, I have been trying so far to adjust somehow to please both, to have both of them pleased, live, live together. It's not happening. I cannot move to Dwarka when my, my wife doesn't want to move to Malvinagar. I am a Malay of Malvinagar constituency. I cannot leave my people. I cannot leave my mother. My wife works for a company which is, which is having its office in Chhatapur. That is five minute journey from Malvinagar. I don't know why does she want to live in Dwarka only. Right. Now, this has been when I became a minister. That time uh, when I was Give, being given a government house. Uh, she was very pleased to see the house. She wanted to move in. It was being given Ansel Plaza. I have all the tapes with me. Okay. So then again, possibly I didn't become the minister, so my wife lost hope that she can't get a big house or something of that sort. This was something to be solvable. We could have sat down and solved it. And I... this stretch of this, this things have been stretched this far. What has happened? Is my insult not my wife's insult? Because my wife's insult is still my insult. And that is why I would not say a thing or do a thing 
unless I am pressurized by the law against my wife. Are you trying to say that all this is just because of a difference of opinion over houses? It is because the meeting point is not happening. She wants to stay in Dwarka. I cannot move out to Malvinagar. I cannot leave my mother. At this age, where will my mother go? I have been saying that you come, stay here with me. So when this, uh, in the 49 days of ministry, there was a possibility of getting uh, accommodation in Ansel Plaza. Then, then it was, uh, she, she did consider, she visited that house. She visited that house. But subsequently, again, possibly the chances uh, became almost uh, um, uh, not possible for, for, for this to happen. So this, this again erupted. Well, so you're an attempted murderer because there are problems in the family about who, who is going to live where. That said, is there a message you have for your wife? No, I'm not an attempted murderer because of that. I'm an att attempted murderer because police officials were pressurized by the political masters to put that 307. But I just respect my wife too much. I love her. And I, with folded hands, I say that the, your insult is my insult. I expect that my insults would be yours also.